Okay guys, so here is the Brady apartment building. The lobby area is so beautiful, seating for you to just chill out. Just giving me a hotel vibe, right? Like it's like super luxurious. Here is the complimentary coffee machine. You should show me how to use it. Okay. Super nice. In addition to the free Here, Eric, right there. Hi. Um, but we have free fitness classes. So every oh. Saturday morning at 10 a.m., Tuesday evening at 6 p.m., we actually have a, a wonderful on site instructor that works mm -hmm. with our residents. Mm -hmm. He'll come right out here. He'll line everybody up. If it gets too warm or it's raining or whatever, he'll bring them into the wellness center. Okay. And, uh, but it's just a lot of fun. Okay. People really enjoy it. Here's one of the big deals about the Brady, is we actually have direct quad access in and out to the uh, Katy Trail. And the Katy Trail, are you familiar with the trail? So it's it's a, like a walking thing? Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is like three mile venue, so it goes all the way from Highland Park, multi-million dollar homes, to uh, uh, Victory Park, where there's American Airlines Center, concerts. Oh, okay, okay. The Mavericks basketball games, there are hockey games as well. Okay. In fact, we have five Dallas Star hockey players that live here. Nice. Which are cool. And, uh, but really convenient. People, instead of getting into the traffic down in Victory Park, there's a lot of traffic, so beware, there's a lot of traffic in Victory Park. Um, people that live down there have a hard time getting in and out when, when there are events. But with that being said, people will just walk on the trail to the I want to point this out. So we live in a flight path. So I want you to notice on the tour, you're not going to be able to hear anything in the building. It's concrete and steel construction, double pane glass. So you'll notice the whole time we're in there. Nice. Because I saw that another apartment had that issue. I was just like, oh no. <laughs> yeah, I know. And with just the construction of the building it really makes a big difference. Hey. Hey, here's the and this is Miguel. This is our, some of our on-site staff. Nice to meet you. And, um, but uh, we just had a bridal shower here. 25 young ladies had a fully catered. They had the doors open, access to the grill and fire pit. It was a little cooler okay. when, they, when they had the uh, your event. But you actually, as you can see, all of our lounges and lobbies are all Wi-Fi accessible. Okay. Uh, just like the lobby uh, in the front, all, the, all this is new, new furniture out here as well. Mm -hmm. um, you can see back there is be a great place to have a Zoom meeting potentially mm -hmm. or uh, just to get together. Mm -hmm. um, perfect really for to cater a party. So you um, too. So one of those is housekeeping and one of those Okay. Okay. <laughs> so let's go here to our right. And this is our wellness center for Singapore. So the, it sounds like you're going to have a new chapter in your life. Yes. Yes. So this is Addison down here. Addison actually nice. moved from Chicago. Her and okay. Rich. And uh, it's really, really nice. This is a nice gym. It is really nice. Fully loaded, really well maintained. Uh, great views of the trail. And yeah. In fact, Airbnb, Texas Apartment Association, Airbnbs are written into the contract as being illegal. Okay. So they should be, they really shouldn't have those um, for obvious reasons, right? It's not, it's not safe for the residents. Package go missing. Packages were missing. Yeah. So no packages go directly to the door. Okay. Okay. So it's either going to go here to the USPS area. Mm -hmm. So because we have so many VIPs here, we don't use residents' name or apartment numbers on the boxes. Uh, we assign private box numbers. Um, but with that being said, we have this USPS area. We also have Luxor lockers. 
okay. for Amazon and FedEx yes. delivery that you can access with a code. Right? Okay. In addition to these two areas, we also have lockers, all that, all types of. Okay. All these lobbies are again all Wi-Fi accessible. So Christmas and Thanksgiving last year we actually had a um, we actually had a um, resident event. Both the out there they have turkey legs, corn dogs. <laughs> they are um, big on turkey turn. legs out here. I was just like, I mean, what? I guess. <laughs> I've never been to an event other than that one that had turkey legs. But they're really, really nice. On their laptops doing Zoom meetings. Wow, this is beautiful. And this is the best apartment pool I hear at every tour. Wow. Do a little walk around. Wow. It's warm. But we have a pool concierge here on the weekends as well. And we'll stand over here in the shade. We don't have to, we don't have to bake. <laughs> Oh, it's like an infinity pool. It is. Yeah. It's a beautiful infinity pool right there. Yeah. Here. That's Keith over there and the attorney. Hi. <laughs> okay. And we have a fire pit and grill back there as well. Okay. Five cabanas. Each cabana has a ceiling fan and a TV. Do you have to um, rent it out to use it? No, it's first come, first serve. First serve, okay. Usually if you're here by about noon on the weekend, you'll we'll, we'll, we'll get away. Okay. So... Again, grill and fire pit back there. Mm -hmm. The grills are always kept super clean. Okay. So here is the first apartment, and it is a studio apartment. It's unique in a sense because it's giving one bedroom, but really it's a studio. And you'll see why in a second with the sliding barnyard door. So we're walking in, and you see, you know, the whole aesthetics of the apartment so far. Dishwasher. There's the stove and everything. He's showing me the washer and the dryer. And I believe he said every unit in the building has one. And I'm just admiring it because it's a front loader and not a top loader. <laughs> He's showing me the quality of the um like the furniture and the doors and everything. So yeah. Still admiring <laughs> the washing machine. Um, and there is a lot of cabinets. In, within this apartment which is really great because normally when it's a smaller apartment there's not much storage but in this case there is an abundance of storage and again it is a studio so look at all the storage it's it's amazing nice size um living room space like this is a and again this is a studio look at these windows look at these humongous windows balcony which is a a plus for me because I, I believe that's on my list of must-haves. Here in there's the sliding barnyard door. Here's the bedroom. Again, it's a studio. Look at this. Like, what? Good size bedroom. He said that a, the person had a king size bed in here and a dresser. So there you go. Here's the bathroom. The bathroom was a nice bathroom. Um, have no complaints. The closet was a good size closet, but I mean I wish it was a little bit bigger. So it was pretty over it, overall it was pretty cool. At this point I'm just telling him that I would prefer to see another apartment because it's a bit too small for me. So here's apartment number 2 and this is my style. Look at this kitchen, look at the counter space, the island, everything. Like this is my style. The living room area is a good size portion for me. Um, a lot of storage within this apartment, which you'll see in a, in a, in a few. Here is the balcony. I can put a table, a chair out here. So I love that. Making my way to the bedroom. And again, uh, this is actually a little bit bigger um, than the last apartment. I can definitely put my bed and my dresser in here. So there, you know, I'm loving that already. Nice size window. The bathroom. Oh my gosh, the bathroom. So 
I get in there, double vanity, and I didn't notice until after I turned around, look what I see. A bathtub and a standing shower. What? Like, that That won me over. I was I was in love by, be j just by seeing this. So I've never had that before. It's either one or the other. So, yeah, and a tub is what I really want. And look at the closet. The closet is a good size closet. Good size um, closet with the shut, like the built-in shelf system. There was a really high rod that I, I personally could not reach, which I'll show you in a second. But he claims that people used it for like winter clothes to hang it up there out of reach, I guess, whatever. But a very good size apartment. I, I'm actually very sold on this, but it's kind of priced a re like really high on my budget. So... I'm not really sure, but overall, this is a beautiful apartment. Definitely a top contender. I'm not sure if I said it already, but this apartment also does come with a washer and a dryer. I believe all units come with the washer and a dryer, dry bar, all the cabinets look at the cabinets look at the color scheme just an amazing apartment great flow of things and there's also shelves in the room with the washer and the dryer so that way you can store your detergent and fabric softener there as well uh, this is just an amazing apartment definitely a top contender now this is a two-bedroom apartment not really for me i just decided to look just for the sake of it Oh my gosh! So eight, four, and above get have gas. Gas okay. is complimentary. You don't okay. have to pay for that. Oh, okay. Those two That's bedrooms they have gas. Also have a wine fridge. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Eight, eight, and up also have the dovetail and the soft close. Okay, so there's no slamming. That's good. Right. Wow. Okay, so this is the espresso. And then we're going to save the best for that. Oh, that's the, that's the best? Okay. Oh, snacks. Grab something? Yes. What do I want? Let me take that M&M's. Everybody goes to the M&M's. Actually, the uh, No, 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 the name. That's fine. <laughs> if you want to put the phone or the peanuts. I, uh... Um, so, again, fill these doors. Yeah. The washing machine that my father approves. He is against the top loader, so oh, I always look for these. Of... And I'm assuming this is the HVAC again. It yeah. Is. Thank you. This is the bathroom, so this it's like a Jack and Jill for this someone is in here. Tiny, tiny for Brady. Uh huh. Oh wow. That's a deep tub. Oh nice. Yeah. Nice size closet. Tiny. Wow. And this is the guest closet. Mm -hmm. so guest bathroom. So it's going to be a little smaller. Mm -hmm. Look at the bedroom. And look at the views. Wow. 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 These. This view is. And that's about as much air as you hear, and then it lasts for like three seconds. You know what's funny is that um, in New York, you, it's it's actually worse. <laughs> so this noise, I don't want the noise, but that noise is not is not what I is like. Yeah, right. this is a good size. Wow, look at these high. Okay, so you're you're about to lose it. The bedroom? Yeah, go back and check out the bathroom. Oh, oh, what? It looks like single family, doesn't it? So I feel like this multifamily living that looks like single family. Yes. I don't care, a water closet. What? And then you're going to lose it when you go back and check out that. The clock? said the other day, said, oh, I see you got your own car wash. And I was like over here, and I was just laughing. I go, I'm going to use that. <laughs> this is... Uh, I love that there's both. 
So if yeah, some, we'll see. That's yes, fine. my father would love this. Wow, this closet. Oh, this just confirms I need to make more money. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. So I want to show like, this to you because that could be a possibility for you. I feel like Maybe. I'm at the age where I don't want to you roommate want, anymore with my own. Privacy. If I had it my way, I'll just rent this for myself. There you go. <laughs> but uh, wow. Soft clothes. Yeah. Yes. Oh yes, because I that's good. No slamming. Nice. Wow. So as I'm entering the bedroom, I'm just feeling like, you know, this was a nice apartment. I just am in a point in my life where I don't want a roommate. I want to live by myself. And although this is a, a great apartment, I mean, this is a little past my budget. But I mean, overall, what do you guys think? Do you guys like this apartment? Would you live here? What are your thoughts? Drop your comments in, this sec in the comment section below.